I forgot to tell you. This is a quick update. But I think it was two videos ago. Like the one right before the one I just put up. It says my Xbox died. Well, I got it to work. Um I've been seeing people online using the towel trick. Now I said this on my butt mash TV channel too, but this is for all the people that are just subscribed here that haven't seen that video. But I use the towel trick. The towel trick, if you haven't heard of it, is if you get the red rings of death or if you get the um error where your um your your Xbox 360 is not outputting any video but it's outputting sound, then you can use the towel trick. Now what it is is now I'm not responsible for whatever happens to your Xbox, but I tried it and it worked. So if you decide that you want to do it, I'm not responsible. Just my disclaimer. But um, you wrap your Xbox three. You first of all you unplug the AV cable and you unplug everything. Unplug your hard drive. Unplug your um, memory card, USB, anything that's plugged into it. Unplug everything and just leave the power cord plugged in and then you wrap it in a towel and wrap it in another towel or wrap it in a blanket wrap it in something that's going to keep all the heat inside and not let it escape um, you leave it sitting there for about 20 to 25 minutes now I don't know if everybody's Xbox does this but what mine did after about 20 minutes was it shut off and it shut off because it lacked ventilation now when I took it out the, the, it shut off and it gave me two red rings I'm assuming that's bad ventilation error but when I took it out of the blanket and took it out of the towel, I let I put it back on. I plugged everything back in and I turned it off. Let it sit there for like five minutes. I turned it back on and it works again. So my video output is working again. That was my problem. I there was no video output. Um, I really had nothing to lose because I had got my Xbox from GameStop like two years ago. So mine was out of warranty. I couldn't. Send it, well, I probably could have sent it to um, Microsoft, but it would have cost eighty dollars. So even if it does give you, say, give you the red rings of death, and you were going to send it out to Microsoft anyway, I mean, you could do this, and it would give you more time to play. Now, I would recommend installing your games if you do this, because I the only time I saw problems with my Xbox overheating and the the thing messing up was when I started playing Splinter Cell Conviction only because I didn't have that game installed. Now I have Super Street Fighter 4 installed so the disc doesn't spin and it just um it's just on. Like the only thing on is the fan, so it doesn't it shouldn't overheat. Now when I saw it online it said some people had to do this every three or four days. Now if you're playing your Xbox a whole lot like every day, then you might have to do it again. But um I'll let you know if I have to do it again. But um the towel trick is confirmed by me that it works. So, um, if you were skeptical about it, it does work. I didn't want to be like one of those shady videos where, you know, they show you they did it and it's just that video. It's really grainy. It's their Xbox zoomed in on with a towel over it and a little, little light sticking out. And they're like, well, you just wrap it in a towel and you let it sit. And then time passes and then they unwrap it and it works. And it's just like, okay. I don't believe that but honestly it works I was out of an Xbox for a whole day and a half or something like that and I was playing on my uncle's Xbox because I thought my AV cable was messed up and I was gonna buy a new one but I found out it was my Xbox and the problem with the video not showing is the GPU chip on the inside it um, it loosens up from all the heat I, I'm assuming and gives you no video like at first your your screen will be greenish like you have a greenish tint and then it, you get no video after that um so what I'm assuming the towel trick does is it resets all the chips now not resets electronically but resets them like reseats them in wherever they're sitting it probably like remelts whatever was around it and then when you you know it, it slides back into place and then you, you then like from the extreme overheating. So then you know you let it cool down, it gets back to what it's supposed to do, and it works again. So I'm playing Street Fighter 4 now. I think you can Yeah. True I'm playing playing Xbox 360 now. So it does work. Alright, let me um this is just quick update, so you know. Alright.